What's up, gamers? How are we doing today? I've got a uh, great tip slash hack slash, uh, I guess some people call it a cheat, I guess. But uh, more or less, I've had a ton of people ask me uh, how I've been picking up sticks or anything off the ground really fast uh, like this. So, uh, yeah, this works with uh, anything that in requires like the E key or the G key on keyboard and mouse. Now, this is possible on controller, but I would imagine only possible if you have paddles. So more or less, more or less how I do it is. Uh, so here, let me show you. So here is what I use. This is the Steel Series software you can get the steel series software if you have a steel series mouse logitech or corsair or if you just have some knockoff type mouse uh with extra buttons on it or whatever you can just download this uh auto clicker as well but i'll pull up my steel series uh program here and i will show you exactly more or less what it does and i'm pretty sure it's universal for all the different programs i don't have a corsair or logitech mouse so i can't test it for you but uh once this opens here sorry i should have had it open already uh, we will go into the actual mouse settings itself. And uh, more or less what I did was I have these uh, button four and button five, which on my mouse are these two little black side buttons there. Uh, and more or less all you're telling your mouse to do is to repeatedly press the E key or to repeatedly press the G key. So you can click on the E here. Uh, I did the keyboard buttons drop down as, as well, selected the E key. And uh, you can trigger it to play it once, play it many times, repeat while pressed, toggle auto repeat or toggle hold. So mine's on repeat while pressed, which allows me to, you know, come over here and uh, say I want to build something. I got all these pallets here and literally we just uh, hold down the button. It's a whole lot better than quick build, you know, like if you're wanting to hold down to quick build or whatever. Um, I guess that would look like uh, like this. So it's gonna, you know, save you a ton of time. A lot of people have been looking for this video, so here it is. Hopefully this helps, um, and uh, you can, I did check this auto clicker link here. This is a good link. I, I tried it out and then I took it away because it was making weird things happen with two programs running at the same time doing the same thing. But this, um, I'm gonna leave all these links for SteelSeries, Logitech, and Corsair, and auto clicker in the description. I'm sorry if you have another name brand mouse that I don't have in this list um then i'm sure you can figure it out but uh and also on controller guys for my controller people um you know they make controllers with paddles on the back where you can go into your uh key bind options in the game it allows you to bind two separate buttons to something uh and what you're going to want to do is i believe it is hold on let me get the correct name here so it's e and g so it's use and interact you could do like d-pad left and right maybe i don't know what the d-pad does but it's probably something useless um you could do like d-pad left and right on the interact and use thing uh so currently it's b or or x i guess or you could just do uh you could do x and then also add in left d-pad so you could just go like blah, 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 blah. you just press them both real fast but that's about the only way you can do it on controller guys hopefully uh this helps out and uh yeah make sure you like this video for me so it blows up and everybody gets it because I know everybody wants it. But either way, thanks, guys. We'll see you on the next video. Peace.